We're gonna do a neon belly sequence, all right? So if I have, and I start in side control, I like to put my thumb under his head pretty far, not superficial, I don't wanna be pulling here. So deep here, I put my other hand here on the hip. You can, of course, put it on the, on the hip. I'm sorry, I put it on the knee, but you can't put it on the hip. Put it on the knee here and I pop up, okay? In this case, you can put it across the belt or up on an angle, but I don't want all my weight on my, on my hip here, okay? I want all my weight on my knee. So when I'm here, I'm gonna extend it and pull my hands up while I'm putting pressure here. His normal response is to push on my knee to get rid of it. So when I does that, I switch and I trap over that shoulder, right? And I put pressure on his chest. Now again, he doesn't like it, so he puts pressure to get rid of it. I take this hand from his collar, put it on his hand, and I spin and sit on his belt. And now if you'll see this rotation, I only have his head and his arm. So I reach under, grab his tricep, pull it up, and I bring my knee close. And now I have arm bars, I have triangles, I have a ton of stuff to finish with from here. Okay? So, one more time. I have side control, hand here, hand here. Pop up, knee on belly, he pushes it off, he doesn't like it. I switch, pushes it off, he doesn't like it. Sit.